computer science videos here today to show you guys in the tutorial how to add the multi-factor authentication method to your office 365 account on a mac computer without further ado let us start the video so in the tutorial you need to have access to a mac computer and account for office 365 you can go to all my previous tutorials to watch all the videos that i've done on office 365 before you come to this so we can now start the tutorial Let's now go all the way down to the dock, go to Launchpad, go to the web browser, which is far in this case. Now navigate to Office 365, make sure you are signed into the account. And now the purpose of this tutorial is to demonstrate how we can add the multi-factor authentication method, which means we would require two stages, which will allow only you to access your account because Let's say you leave your account all on autofill. Somebody comes to the computer, signs in as you. You'll never be notified because you haven't added the two-step verification method. Now let's go all the way to the left-hand side navigation menu. Go to admin. Go to the top left navigation menu again. Go to users, active users multi-factor authentication this will take you to the sign-in page let's click on next you must be signed into your account yes sign in keep your account secure your organization requires you to set up the following methods of providing who you are Let's click on next. Set up the account. Next. Scan the code using Microsoft Authenticator. So. If you haven't downloaded the application on your phone, you can do that now. Open up the application. I agree. Scan a QR code, yes, there we go, correct, approve, notification approved, click on next. And now you would be required to enter a phone number. So now I will enter my phone number. Click on next, they will text me the code. Let me add the code. Next. Your phone was successfully registered. Done. And now, as we can see on screen, we have not enabled the multi factor authentication status. Click on the name, enable, enable the multi factor authentication method. That's all done. So now what would happen is, let's now sign out of the account. It's already done that for us, or has it? No, it has not, sign out. Click into the account. Sign into the account. Yes, that's my password. You would have to open up the application and then approve the sign in yep yes and there we go so let's now quit safari and so that's it for this video i'll see you guys in my next tutorial 
Thanks for now. Thank you for making it towards the end of the video. Be sure to subscribe to my channel, Computer Science Videos. Be sure to check out the previous video on screen now, or you can ideally click on the playlist and watch all the journey for Computer Science Videos from the start until now.